If your headlight bulbs are too dim and have this ugly yellow color, you can always replace them with more energy efficient and brighter LED bulbs. Let's take a look at how to install LED bulbs and then compare them to the old halogen ones. The average price for automotive LED bulbs are somewhere between $40 and $80 right now. And I'm personally going to be installing these last feed bulbs. They are rated for 6,000 lumens. They have a bright cool white color and active cooling system, meaning they're actually cooling fans and metallic heat sinks built into each of these bulbs to help with dissipating heat generated from the bulbs. I'd say the bulbs are pretty well built and I like how the electrical connector has this extra cable which will give you more flexibility if you're trying to plug it in in the tight space. Currently a pair of these bulbs costs around $60 and if you're interested I'm going to post a link down in the description area below. Installation process is pretty simple as long as you have decent amount of space to reach the back of the headlights. Install one LED bulb at a time. That way you can adjust it similar to the original one. We'll talk about adjusting the new bulbs a little bit later. In my case, this is H4 bulb socket. The wiring harness just pulls right off. Next, remove the rubber dust shield. Then release the spring clamp and take out the old bulb. Note the installation position of the bulb here. One tab is pointing up and two of them are pointing down, just like the Mercedes sign. When comparing two bulbs, notice how the light source is on the same level. That is very important for the proper light pattern. LED bulbs should have the shape closely resembling the original halogen ones. Installing glass fit LED bulbs is slightly different. Since it has much larger housing, you can't close the retaining spring. First, twist and detach the base plate and then install it into the headlight and secure it with the spring clamp. Replace the dust shield. Insert new LED bulb. And finally connect the wiring harness. Here's what the old and new colors look like next to each other. Now we need to make sure that the new bulb is properly adjusted. Make sure that the bulb is fully inserted and that it's not at the angle. Rotate it and make sure the light is going in 3 and 9 o'clock directions. Much like it does on the original halogen bulb. At night park next to the wall or garage door and turn on the headlights. Try to replicate the beam pattern as close as possible to the original bulb on the other side. If the edge of the light beam is too high or too low, you can correct it using the adjustment screw. Once you find the perfect installation position, repeat the same steps for the second headlight. The adjustment process may take some time and at the end it may not look identical to the factory bulb because of the fact that LED light bulbs don't have the same shape as the halogen ones. So these lights are definitely much brighter but the light pattern may not be as uniform as the halogen one. You may notice darker spots here and there. If necessary, you can try to repeat the adjustment process until you find the best possible outcome. All right, that's it for today. I hope you liked the video. Thanks for watching and have a nice day.